my friends. Look at my mask of the day. Ooh, snow's coming this week for New Year. So, I'm a little crabby. Could be better. Could be better. But, I'm excited because this is my daily vlog. Consistency and content, they say. But, today I was thinking about, you know, I think I've gotten a little lazy since I stopped working two jobs. I miss being on the go, 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 go. So I'm actually kind of getting excited about getting ready to get a second job. Just be on the go, go, go. Put a little extra money in that pocket. Because you know what? Either way, I'll make money off of this shit. Or well, the mess I do with these videos and my music that I want to work on. No. So, it'd be good for me. I got some goals to make come true this next year. Slowly but surely, like a turtle, they say. It's a turtle race. And I try to stay, try to get, I'm trying to get back in a positive attitude. It's been kind of, it's been a lot of ups and downs. And I'm sure everybody else is having ups and downs. But that's why you always have to be optimistic and get that things always could be worse. Today at work, I literally did three people's jobs. On top of, well, well, including mine as one. So my job with two other people's jobs on top. To, and it's just like, ah! What? kind of realize I love the grind, I love the effort, because this is a new goal of mine, to be able to do it, so I know I'm getting better if I can do my job and two other people's jobs. And it's kind of, uh, kind of motivates me in a little bit where I'm going, it's just like, I'm doing three people's jobs, but I'm getting paid to do one. So that always may, brings me back to, I work 10 jobs and I only get paid for one. And, kind of true. They have different variables of positions and the roles you have in other people's lives and your lives, people count on you, people respect you, and you know what, if you don't, don't think you do, you probably do, like, so many people are blind to the eye, it's like, well, people will look at me to get this shit done, but I also look at people to keep me in a good mood, like certain people that I go to and talk to, and they probably don't think nothing of it at the end of the day, but truly I'm grateful for it, because if I didn't have that one or two people to rant to, like, oh man, I'd be ran like crazy, and it's been nice, it's kind of, feels like a family at work, so I'm, you know, I'm always down to, down to bust my ass and cry, and they know not to push me while I'm already, already pushing myself. And, uh, yeah, things got to be different this is 2021, and everybody's just got to, you know, if it gets worse, we'll get through it, we'll get through it, like, I tell people at my work, don't get worried till I get worried, when I start panicking, you need to panic. I've lived life trying not to worry about things, trying not to stress. Things stress me out. Certain things like I could change that wouldn't stress me out, but it's not to the point of change yet. And it's just like, where do I go in life now? What do I do with life now? And, uh, and I know I'm not the only one that feels like this. Sometimes people feel stuck. Sometimes people feel like change. want to be the best version of yourself and that's kind of where I'm getting at. Just stay strong. Stay tough. Keep working on your hobbies. Look at my dumbass. I get bored and try to think of different ways to make you laugh. Make people laugh. And it's just it's my thing. This is what I like to do in my free time. Now well, granted I can make money off and have a second job. But, you know, what if I do both? There's no reason why I couldn't like, I don't know anymore, people. I don't know about 
on anything anymore. And those rims on that car do not match and are ugly as fuck. But anyway. You gotta worry about yourself at the end of the day. You worry about your family because it's family over everything. Like, at the end of the day, about the people you go home to. And you just grind to be better because you, you have people that care about you. They, and you should care about them too. Everybody's got a different personality. Sometimes, you know, you can't stand the person that much, but you still love them. Like, trust me, me being the black sheep of the family, I am that kind of special in many people's lives. I'm irritating, annoying, and realizing how big my family actually is. It's, it's nice. Nice to see things grow, things gain. You know, life's rough. You know, I'm sure I'm gonna go through many more <laughs> parts of rough, <laughs> parts of life that are rough. Like, I haven't even been raising a kid or anything. I'm just like, what happens when I do? Oh, life's going to be crazy. This is going to happen so fast. Things happen fast like that. You know, I'm, I'm getting old. I'm totally over it. The person I used to be, the person I'm going to be is going to be a lot better than the person I used to be. And, you know, the whole rewire construction, my mentality, it's just, it takes process. Things take time. People can't just change overnight. It takes baby steps. And you need to know that if you're working towards something. It takes baby steps. It's not going to happen overnight. You have to build the tank. You have to build the skills. You have to build the standards. And, you know, change the standards you're living by to live in the standards that you are living by now. Because I can tell you my standards have heightened a lot over the past few years. And, uh... I was at high standards, low standards, now I'm back to high standards, but I'm trying to prepare my future so I don't go back to low standards. And hopefully my rough part of life is just, maybe hopefully I've seen <laughs> my, it's gotten worse before it's gotten better. So there's only one way, up, way to go and that's up and to keep grinding, keep wasting your time on it. It's not a waste potentially for you working towards a goal or trying to fulfill something that you've been wanting to do for a while. And you know, it is how it is. And it takes time. You have to stay focused. And I bet you if I put more time and focus on my music, I could have done something with it a long time ago. But I haven't. Because I put focus on stupid things and small things in life. I don't know how I got him in front of this guy when he was behind me. That's weird. Well, I was behind him. But this is my vlog for the day. I hope you all have a safe and splendid night. Remember, check me out. Is it Thursday or Friday? Friday for New Year's? No, Thursday night. I'm trying to DJ. I'm trying to work on my little set I'm trying to put together. Remember to check out my Etsy. Get my mask set. Appreciate it. I hope you all stay up. And uh, stay positive. And don't let the anxiety of what is going to happen in our future in the world with this COVID and pandemic. So stay positive. And, you know, sometimes you might be doing better than somebody else. I mean, you can't be a good person and help them to become a better person. It's been done to me and I've done it to people. It's called the domino effect. If you, if you spread good, good, it's, good will pass on. If you spread bad... It's just a domino effect. It just keeps going on. So what would you rather be? The person who spreads good or the person to spread it for bad? So stay optimistic. Don't panic. We've already been through hard times. And if it does get worse, we're strong. We'll be together as a community to get through this. Because you know what? A nation is still a community because everyone's divided in states. Like, that's just how it is. Deferred, uh, deferred power or whatever you want to call it. All right, folks, stay strong, stay peaceful, over and out.